All right, speaking of not liking his kids, Brian McKnight is uh, clearing the air about his biological daughter and discussing the lawsuit that she filed against him in uh, 2020 for defamation and breach of contract. Take a look. We settled the case earlier this year, and I agreed to pay Brianna some money, but here's the interesting part. She sued me for defamation and breach of a million-dollar life insurance policy, and I agreed to pay her $318,000 with no admission of any wrongdoing whatsoever. You heard that right. She dismissed a million-dollar case in exchange for payment of $318,000 with no admission that I did anything wrong. The more he talks, the worse he makes this thing. He needs to just shut up. He looked pathetic as fuck. I, I, he I didn't pathetic know he as fuck. Attra- he's an attractive man. <laughs> no, he looked he like, no, he like, he like a pathetic sissy because the reality of the situation is when it comes to a daddy and a daughter, there shouldn't have never been a goddamn case in the first place. Right. There shouldn't have been a case. There shouldn't have been a case. You know what and for your daughter, th- th- there should never be an instance where a parent should say anything about a child that could remotely be filed for defamation. So I'm sorry. This is not a win for you. You still look a creep. And you it feels what? like he thinks he's gonna be, uh, he can be justified by yeah. putting out this narrative that they're ungrateful. So you can question your daughter's sexual history and, 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 and oh my God, I didn't know he was such an asshole. Yeah. And that's the part, that's the part that I, I, I wanna chime in on that, Claudia. Who knew? Who knew that he was so disconnected? Because I've always thought that he was upstanding. I thought he was an incredible dude, you know, just from an outside looking in. He said in his statement, he said it took him 30 years to build his brand. That brand is something that it was a false brand because it only took him five minutes watching that video to put it all in question. He has been terrorizing those kids with those shady ass posts, it, the passive, not even passive aggressive, aggressive posts. Aggressiveness. Oh, I, my life is not, not I, you're the best daughter ever when you have a real a biological daughter. That is so mean. And Man, baby Brian, like another Brian Jr. You already have a Brian Jr. If your children are spoiled, entitled brats, that still falls on you. That's your fault. You made them that way. And so the, that's your wife. failure. You think you, you, you think you read in them. You read in yourself. You reared them. But also, what new wife would sit by and, and allow him to say these things about his other kids and including his only daughter? One that's wife, riding the life. Other wife would do that. His new one wife. that's one that's riding the lifestyle and the money. That that one, that can a good wife or a good partner or a good even friend would say, "Look, Brian, you can have a feeling about your kids, but to put that out there in the public with that, even not even just your brand, the humiliation yeah. you're causing to your children, you're not just. There's nothing you can say that justifies this kind of treatment, like." Terrible, trash behavior.